Good morning, guys. It's Wild Side Ryan Twenty One here, and this morning I am going to bring you a very cool Hornby train set review in the form of this: the Industrial Freight. However. I do actually own another industrial freight. I'll show you. It's this one. This is the industrial freight I think came out in 2019, I think. But this one basically, it contained an O4 locomotive a box van, a red plank wagon, and a towed brake van. No, no, towed, towed from Thomas the Tank Engine. <laughs> but this one isn't green, it's black. No, green? I said green, I mean grey, sorry. I mean, sorry, I'm sorry there, guys. I said green instead of grey, that's what colour towed it as, grey. Or silver, grey. You get the point. But we're not focusing on the 2019 industrial freight. No, 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 no. We're focusing on this industrial freight right in front of me. However, this set did not come out in 2019. This came out in 1999. So making this a 20, 23 years old, I think. Yeah, I think 23 years old. So like we all know, what makes this set rather interesting is these three wagons. In the form of 7-Up, Pepsi and Tango. And of course the Red O Foil Locomotive. So the first thing we'll have a look at it's the box, which is right here. Here it is. Look at this, though, subscribers. Look at this for a box. So the same thing like we know like when I did the review on the review of the Rambler and local freight. So I know picture of the train here, and then four pictures <laughs> in the background, and then on this side is basically. What you get, and the trap map, the oval, and then of course here's the information if you want to read it. So pause it if you want to read it, be free. And of course, the amazing thing up like we all know. I have to do it from another way because this one's got a sticker in the way. Do it from this way, should be alright. Yeah, should be alright. So, like we all know, so what you get in the industrial freight basically, you get a red 040 locomotive which has 105 on it, and then, then like, say, the three most coolest wagons you'll ever see. So, we have a 7 up. Seven plank wagon, I think, if I'm correct. And then a Pepsi small tank wagon. And then the coolest thing, a Tango closed van in really nice orange and black. And that's it. And of course, the back of the box, which is the same thing that we, like we know on, which is on the, um, the Rambler set. So there's nothing to talk about because we've done it with the Rambler. But actually, also guys, yesterday I actually did do a video of this actually running yesterday. So after I've uploaded this video, go onto my channel today and watch it because it's really good. This thing runs rather good. Right. Now let's have a look at the train itself. 
So we're gonna have, we're gonna do first. We'll have a look at the O4 locomotive first, and then the three coolest wagons. So here's the um, O4 locomotive. But the thing is, though, there isn't much de detail on it except. 105 on both sides and then the front of them it's like I said I've said this before it's like it reminds me like the hands on a clock it does and of course you've got golden like chinny for the whistle like the little whistles uh well oh, sorry funnel I mean sorry the funnel damn it <laughs> there isn't much to look at but it's, it's a basic thing, though. Right, we put him to one side. And now we've got to turn our attention to the three most coolest wagons Hornby have ever made. These bad boys. So the first thing we're going to have a look at <laughs> is one of my favourite drinks. It's the 7-Up Wagon. Look at this. So like we know, it's basically in the, the colour that we all know is 7up by now, green. And then of course you've got the 7up logo on both sides. And then a nice colour for the like inside it. But I wish you could I wish you could wish I could imagine somebody putting 7up in this. But that wouldn't be a good idea though, because that if that if it was going around the track, it might the seven up might splash and um, ruin the track. <laughs> that would be very cool though, but very dumb. And now, I don't I don't really drink this drink. However, this is so cool though. It's the Pepsi Small Tank Wagon. Now look at this though, look at this. So like we know, you've got the Pepsi logo on both sides. And then this thing here, this red bit at the top, is where you would actually open the tank up, the tanker up, so you could fill it with Pepsi. And then of course, like, stuff to hold the tank in place, like these red things that you see, like, where the, around the, um the top where you open it but it's just so the tanker doesn't fall out but it's rather nice though isn't it it's rather nice <laughs> but now I think I've saved oh, where do you think you're going where do you think you're going I, th I think I have saved the best piece of rolling stock till last with this the Tango Closed Van. Now look at this. Look at this. I mean, honestly, look, subscribers, isn't this cool? Like, say, an orange roof in black. And then, like, like we know, the Tango logo on both sides. But again, though, this is absolutely incredible. The detail on it's nice. Like I say, the Tango logo on the sides, an orange roof, the black for the van. It's a great combination, orange and black. But hey, that's what colour Tango is, isn't it? Another thing, though, this is the old Tango logo. Because this, this is a very old set, though. Like the Pepsi logos old same as 7up so there you have it guys that is my review of the Hornby industrial freight train set so we hope so we hope you enjoyed this video please remember to leave a comment down below Remember to go and click on the subscribe button to my channel today. And most importantly, try and get me up to 1,000 subscribers if you can, please. And like I said, like I just said, 
after I've uploaded this, check out the video of this run-in. And we'll see you with some more videos. Peace out.